you can use your snapping pops to knock things down. See you, bud. No! Stay out! Stay out! Stupid fart kid. I should have never got that bitch pregnant. school student. But then one day, a freak science accident turned my diabetes into superhuman strength. All right, sidekick. We're supposed to go investigate a girl who might know the location of the missing cat. Follow me. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle's this way. Fucking bitch! Let's see how you like this! I am Captain Diabetes, and this is my faithful sidekick! Oh, okay. Well, move out of the way, huh? I need to go buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive! I'm fine to drive, okay? Get out of here! Hey, give me my keys! You are in no condition, sir! I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look! I'm fine, okay? Give me my keys. I'll return them tomorrow. Give me my fucking keys, you little shit! You think I can dance with this? Let's go! Attack! Ah! Hey, I almost spilled my drink! Let's do this, diabetes and... Whatever the fuck the other little kid is. Give me my fucking keys! Stop him, sidekick! Ah, damn it! Stand back, sidekick. I'll take care of this. Yeah. <laughs> damn, I feel so tired all of a sudden. Hey, I think I dropped my keys. Anyone seen them? I have confiscated them, sir. You're such a little fucking bitch, Captain Diabetes. Get them, sidekick! <laughs> oh, sure. Mess with the sober guy. You, you drive. I will not break the lock. Yes. I'm fine to drive. I'm fine. Okay, okay. Okay, now I'm fine. You should be fine to drive at approximately 11 a.m. tomorrow. It's 11 a.m. somewhere. I'm keeping your keys, and that's final. Hey, what I do? All right, you're gonna get it now. Totally impervious to pain. Okay, I wasn't good to drive before, but now I am. Thanks for, thanks for having my back. Now let me have my key. I'm sorry, but I stand by my previous assessment of your fitness to operate machinery. Oh. You really need to sign up for AA, Mr. Marsh. I'll hold him off, sidekick. I'll get those keys right after this a short little nap. Good night, Mr. Martin. There's a shortcut through human kite space. Kyle's off on another mission right now. We're on our own, sidekick. It's up to us to get to the bottom of this.
The shortcut shop there in the attic. The coon gave us permission to use it. Sometimes, when I... Just one second. This is humankind's secret base. It's hard to make me angry. The coon says it's because my mom farted when she gave birth to me, and that's why I have diabetes. I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift to help fight crime. The shortcut is through that window. I don't have my own secret base, but if I did, at least I'll clean it up before I knew I had super guests coming over. Couldn't even set up the ladder for us. Jeez. Well done, sidekick. This shortcut will take us right into the heart of downtown South Park. Come on, sidekick. Do not be afraid. The fearless hero and his sidekick descend into the dark night, ready to strike down evil and bring peace to the city. You don't think people get diabetes because their mom started doing childbirth, do you? I, I feel like Coon made that up to make Captain Diabetes feel insecure about himself. As you can see, sidekick, at nighttime, South Park is quite a different place. We've got to get into the Peppermint Hippo, to the town square! <laughs> Here it is. Here's where we're going to find the girl. There are sure to be unsavory characters and lots of boobies inside. Come on, let's go inside. Hey, beat it, kids. 21 and over only. Turn this eye, citizen. It is I, Captain Diabetes. I must speak with the ladies inside. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. What to do? Hey, will you kids get out of here already? If you're gonna talk, take it the fuck outside. Hmm, there must be another way in somewhere. Great detective work, sidekick. Now we just need a way up there. Over here, sidekick. I have an idea. Of course! Stand aside, sidekick! Me here. 
Okay, we made it inside the strip club. Wow, these ladies are really, uh, moving. Well, don't freak out, Sidekick. We're superheroes. We can handle this. One of these ladies has information about the missing cat. But who? There's only one thing we can do. We have to pick someone and take him to the VIP room. Find someone and meet me there. One taste of that spicy Take snatch of your encounter. Next up is Cinnamon. Aren't uh, you a little too young to be in here? Come back when you're 21 and I'll let you suck on my implant. You got balls, kid. You remind me of a young me. You two girls ready to party? So this is your friend, huh? She's fucking hot as fuck. That's right. Wouldn't you like to take her to VIP? I don't know. She's kind of short. I like them short. You take the one with the speech impediment. Come on, get some dances. I was thinking we could just go in there and talk for a little while. Yeah, first we get dances, then we talk. Oh, okay. So, have you gentlemen ever had dances from a girl with a penis tattoo? Hey, we didn't come back here to talk, baby. Yeah, no talking until you finish grinding on our chugs. Oh, all right. Okay, sidekick, you know what this means. <sighs> Don't forget to bring a towel. Look, I'm not gonna pay for this. <laughs> Come on, you're killing my buzz here. What kind of move was that? Oh, fuck! Jesus, baby, you're stinking up the VIP room. Oh, great! Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Good! Come on! Oh, no! Oh, come on, you're killing my buzz here. Look, I'm not gonna be what the fuck. Oh, no, stop. Let's, let's just talk. Let's just talk. Okay, shot time. Chat time? Aw, oh, man. So, what kind of work do you guys do? And have you ever danced with a girl here who has a penis tattoo? Why do you keep talking about a stripper with a penis tattoo? Yeah, yeah, Classy, that's her name. Her name is Classy? Yeah, Classy with an I and a little dick that hangs off the C which fucks the L out of the ASS. Of course. Hence the tattoo. We have to name, new kid. Come on. What are you talking about? This is the worst VIP experience ever. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. You ain't going nowhere. Ha-ha! I am the ordinary stripper. I am Captain Diabetes. What? My sidekick and I simply used our powers of disguise to extract information from you. Hey, you won't get away with this, Captain Diabetes. <laughs> oh, shit. My boner's weighing me down. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. That's the last time I pay for a high-priced $20 stripper. The nerve of that feeling! I want to go to one of those communist countries that give out government subsidized jobs. Yeah. Anyone like a dad? I got a group on that'll get me and four friends 30% off shop if we shop before seven. Hey, hey, didn't your pants teach you not to hit strippers? I got a chub in Thailand from a girl who had her own chub. Well, that must have hurt. Surrender, super twerkers.
Before the economy collapsed, you could get a chub and a pitcher's beer for $2.99. night out there be sure to tip your waitresses and maybe buy a drink for the dj next up on the main stage we've got a little bit of hot sauce coming up your way let's give it up for esmeralda that's it the dj calls the bitches names and then the bitches come out of that back room new kid we need to find a way to distract the dj <gasps> i got it gin and tonics always make my mom pass out if we can make one and spike it with something really strong he'll be out for sure go make that drink sidekick all right, guys, we got a special treat for you on the main stage. Please put your hands together for Destiny. Let's keep looking. Hey, that looks like something we can put in a drink. We got a special treat for you on the main stage. Please put your hands together for Destiny. All right, someone finally bought the DJ a drink. That's really nice of you. That went down really good. The DJ sure does appreciate it. Ooh. Oh, oh man, I think someone farted in my drink, guys. I'll be right back. Be sure to tip your winters. Great work, you kid. Wow. All right, guys, put your hands together. Be sure to tip your winters. This thing's about to get a little bit hot on the main stage. Please welcome. Uh, that's right, guys. Let's get her on out here. That's Classy with an eye and a little dick to fuck the hell out of the ASS. Give it up for Classy. Hey, what you calling me out for? I ain't on stage yet. Wait a minute. You ain't the DJ. That must be her, new kid. Oh, shit. It's 5 0. Cops are here. After her. Nobody's allowed back here. Yeah, get lost. Stand aside, ladies. Captain Diabetes and his sidekick need to question that stripper. You want to get to her? You're going to have to go through us. Bring it on. All right, guys, this is your DJ back from the bathroom. Looks like we've got a special treat for you tonight. The two assholes that farted in my drink are about to get fucked in the face by our very own lovely ladies. By the power of Diabetes, 
I implore you to stand down, ladies. These some persistent ass police. We're trying so hard. Here comes our favorite flower of Felatio. Give it up for Fuchsia. Say more, guys. We have to reach the end of the hallway. You can't stand up to my crusty sidekick. Did it just get a lot spicier in here? Oh, that's why it's Esmeralda. Head for the end of the hallway. Damn it, lady. What part of stop them ain't clear? <sighs> I got my stank on that one. There's no reason for this to get ugly. And subbing in from the day shift, give it up for Blaze. Hey, can we turn the house lights down just a touch? We need to get the coffee before the stripper horn overwhelms us. Get them tiny cops before they call more 5-0. Would you bitch slap your mama like that? Shame on you. Come and get me, boy. Get the cover. It's right in pussy. She can smash a watermelon between her thighs. It's Anastasia. Keep moving towards the exit, Jacket. Your day of beating off is over. <laughs> Get it, girl. Take him down, Jacket. Hey, we ain't paid to take this shit from 10 year old John. Okay, guys, better look out for this girl, because she'll stick you right up her butt. It's Rhonda. We got her on the ropes, and I can't keep moving. Those tiny police is getting too close. <laughs> Whoa, mama, lay off my jacket. Go on, jacket, kick their ass. Watch out for our next dancer, people. She's the undefeated titan of twerking. Say hello to Trixie. Here comes the queen of quippies, the mistress of BDSM, your dominatrix dream come true. It's spontaneous bootay. Hey, honey, you ain't ready for this bootay. I'm gonna crush you in my booty cheeks. Let me sit on your face real quick. If you run now, you may live to brag about this. Hell yeah! We're really very sorry it had to come to violence, ladies. You got this, butthole! You never forget your first stripper, right, sidekick? Watch and learn, sidekick! Do yourself a favor and just stay down. I'll show you a VIP experience. Then you're not, I'm coming. Hey. Oh shit! You You don't stand a chance against an ass that size. Another beauty, my the gas. My turn, bitches. This is for 
you. You know where you can stick that. I have eight diamonds. You can't hide from this bouquet, honey. Oh, yeah, baby. Here comes death by spontaneous bouquet. Again. Now you're gonna get it. Get over here, sugar. I'm coming! You tiny cops are about to die and go to booty heaven! Who wants the lap dance? Here we go. I hear that some miners need some crushing. You get them, Fouquet! Afraid to use this thing. Come on, you kid, into the restaurant. We just gotta lift that sign. Send the sign, sidekick. It is time for diabetic rage. Even my diabetic rage can't move this sign. <sighs> oh god. <sighs> it's too much. I need my insulin. I need my. Oh no. Oh god. I'm out of insulin. You gotta help me. I drank the apple juice, but I don't have the insulin. I'm going into diabetic shock. I'm, I'm dying. Oh god. Mom. Mom, I'm dying. Somebody, please. Please. <gasps> This is Coon checking in. How's it going for you guys? Everything cool over there? Okay, keep me updated. You know what makes my fart super bad? Handcrafted text mix. Text mix. Not just any handcrafted text mix. It's gotta be something extra special. You know what to do, new kid. I, I'm alive? What happened? Who are you? Huh? Wait a minute. What happened? I thought I died from diabetes. I remember seeing a bright light. The hand of God reaching towards me. Then somebody farted in my face and I was back. I can almost still smell it. 
Wow, your force can actually move objects in time. That's impressive. Now let's get back to that stripper. Two friends. We found a female, but she's escaped to the Italian restaurant. Requesting backup. You heard him. All coon friends to the Book of the Fagagini. And I said, you know what your problem is? You're an alcoholic. <laughs> you didn't. I did. I said, I said, you can't even go a day without scotch, you lush. <laughs> I just don't get how these people can get high every night and feel like it's okay. Oh, I know. It's like clearly you're trying to run away from your problems. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry, but if you're sticking a cat's ass in your face, you obviously aren't happy with your marriage. <laughs> yes, I think a lot of these druggies do what they do because they're in unhappy relationships. <laughs> they probably get high because they feel trapped somehow with their spouse. That must feel horrible. <laughs> Would anyone like me to go over to- There they are. Where's the girl? She was just here. You didn't see her come in? Uh, no, we were busy sinking our watches. No, we were looking at menus because Cartman made us order food. Fighting crime on an empty stomach is very dangerous, human cat. It's for your own good. Whatever. She couldn't have left. We would have seen her go out the front door. Well, then maybe she's in the back. Okay, you guys check it out. Call us if you need help. We'll be waiting for you with our breadsticks. Just go color on some placemats. Hey, come on, we need to get all this fast in the meatballs out to the customers. These guys look good. What is that? with the raw tomatoes and the pepperoncini. From the sky swoops justice. I'm gonna turn you into a bracciola that make it the mouth water. <laughs> Pretty sure I can fit your whole body in a stock pot, little shit. I'll never let you bastard steal our... Farts are super powerful tools to use in combat. Your new fart power can totally nullify an enemy turn. Your turn is now property of Coon and Friends. I'm gonna violate your health code. That makes no sense! Ow! Okay, let's see what you got, new kid. Oh. I'm gonna force feed you corn and harvest your fatty liver. Right. Hey, I only take abuse from the head chef in this kitchen. This kitchen is about to heat up. You're gonna clean so many pots and pans for that. You're about to become just another stain on my apron. Mm. Watch and learn, newbie. The coon's on deck. The rest of you can kind of stand. They got these guys. I'm gonna put boogers and cum all over you little fuckers. Huh. Uh, tell me when you've had enough. Tell them what you're made of, butthole. Ooh. Keep it up, kid. We might be friends someday. Guess we can store your corpses in the walk-in for a good six weeks. Hold still! You want a cream fresh bukake with that? No, thank you! If they touch me again, I'm making you all bus boys! Human kite, ready to swoop! I'm gonna debone you, kid! I'm sending you home to mama in the doggy bag! Saluti! Hmm. 
Raccoon will bring you dastardly chefs to justice. Wow, we're just making the pasta and the scallopini. This might sting. <laughs> Do that again and I flatten you like a like a did a dip dip piadina. Hey kid, you ever been spatchcocked before? I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> you ever clean out a grease trap, kid? Well you're gonna. I'm gonna grill you under a brick. Yeah. That ought to break down your collagens. Sorry to break up the pizza party. Ah, ah. Pretend that really hurt. My friends are watching. I forecast gentle breezes with a high chance of laser and burning! Dip my balls in your sauce. No, no, not, not the massage. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, this one bleeds real nice. I'm counting on you, partner. <laughs> but Lord's coming out blasting. <laughs> now that's a left-handed spatula. Oh, I'm up? Okay. Who's next? I still make you squeal like a sow. <laughs> Quit screwing around, butt lord. Oh, me or mama, I'm like a lamb to the slaughter. Okay, see you guys later. We're gonna go do some real superhero shit. without insulin to bring me back down. Hmm, maybe we can trigger my diabetic rage somehow. Of course, with my super strength, I could knock it over. But I can't use apple juice without my insulin. We need to find a way to tip that over without resorting to apple juice. Wait, that's it? Your farts, psychic! Your terrible farts have thrown me into fits of rage! Of course! The coon wasn't trying to make me feel insecure when he told me that my mom's farts gave me diabetes. He was trying to help me unlock my true powers! We've got to get through there and get the classy, psychic. For the good of South Park. For coon and friends. I need you to fart on my face. Ready when you are. We did it! The path is clear. It's hard for me to lose control of myself, but if we're ever in a dire situation like that again, psychic, know that you can fart in my face. Negative. None of them are fat and old. 
Then what about the girl? We're still tracking her. We have to find out what she knows. Get going. We're so close, I can smell it. Come on, sidekick. There could be a boss battle coming up. Better make sure you're stocked up on healing items and have your best artifacts equipped. That was a hell of a tip. Hold on, sidekick. Sounds like there could be trouble behind that door. There's someone in there. Get ready. One, two, diabetes! <laughs> See, I told you the cops were chasing me. And you led them here, you stupid bitch? Uh-uh. Who are you calling a stupid bitch? Do I look like your mama? That's digging up, classy! These kids are cops? That ain't no cop. That's Captain Diabetes. When he was born, his mom farted during labor and it gave him diabetes that he uses to fight crime. That is not how people get diabetes. If they aren't cops, then we can shoot them. Along with this bitch, too. Oh, shit. Y'all turning on me? I knew I shouldn't have went into business with y'all Tony Soprano-looking motherfuckers. So long, Captain Diabetes. Let's see your diabetes save you now. Uh-oh. Ah! What the? I want my keys! I don't have your keys, man. Ah! He's wasted on red wine. Red wine drunk is the worst drunk there is. Ah! Ah! Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, Captain Diabetes. This is it. Give me my fucking keys. You are in no condition to drive. Then die. Reasonable, Mr. Marsh. Let me call your wife. Leave Sharon out of this, you little prick. But. Uh uh, that's not fair. Y'all can't be using your ass to speed up time and skip people's turns and shit. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. I feel no pain. Punch someone for the coon, Fart Lord. You cannot have your key. I feel sicker. What you doing? Like, damn, they got you all weak and shit. You better not lose, nigga. Feel the wrath of human touch. Uh, Why you keep letting them hit you like that? Duck or something? Shit, shit. Hang on. Sharon's texting me. I can't type. Why the fuck can't I type? Why are my thumbs so big? Hey Siri, fucking take a note, tell my wife, fuck off, cause I'm fighting. Poop emoji. Done it without you guys, but I'm glad you were here to watch. All right, I'm gonna take a cab. There, nobody drinks and drives on Captain Diabetes' watch. Aye, aye, shit. 
Look, all I know is there's a kingpin trying to get new high-grade drugs out on the street. It's somebody trying to bring the Italians and Chinese crime families together and shit. Enough small talk. Where is Scrambles? Scrambles? We need this reward money for our superhero franchise. Oh, shit. Y'all just want a cat? So then there's Cisco. He just some low-class asshole started working two months ago. He be talking all this shit about making money off the crime in the city because some big shot white boy be running all the drugs and all the hookers and shit, right? Okay. Uh-uh, but not me. I'm my own pimp, you know what I'm saying? It's like I got one investment in this world, and that's my pussy, and I ain't putting no mortgage on that to some high-paying nigga talking about trying to make more money off crime and shit. Classy, classy, I'm sorry, but what, what about the cats? Oh, that Cass? Okay, that's his little Asian freak named Yakibaba or some shit like that. He going around paying all these little sixth graders to take people's cats. That's fucked up. I think taking that pussy and, like, taking mine, you know what I'm saying? That's like criminal shit. Where do the cats go? I can tell you, but I ain't saying shit until I know I'm safe, you understand? These niggas ain't playing, and I need to know you gonna protect my ass. Eric Cartman, do you have any idea what time it is? This is a school night. Mom, not now. We're seriously onto something. You kids all get home now, or I'm calling your parents. Sorry, Mrs. Cartman. Please don't tell my mom. And who is this stripper woman? These cone friends offer me protection. Well, she's not staying here. Fine. Fast pass. Take her to your house. Okay. <laughs> And now, the news program that starts your day off right. Good morning, South Park. Good morning, South Park. A new vigilante took to the streets last night and has apparently single-handedly taken down the Famboni crime family. Here with more is a midget in a bikini. Tom, I'm standing outside the Boca de Fagaccini where the vigilante declared war on crime in South Park. Security camera footage showed a young person farting in people's faces on their balls. It was just terrifying. The kid came in and just, just started farting on people. It was out of nowhere, man. Maybe someone's finally standing up to what's wrong with this city. This new kid's a hero. The kid's a menace, if you ask me. How long before he or she kills an innocent person? How long before Daredevil becomes the Punisher? Huh? Three seasons? Three seasons! Police called to the scene found a treasure trove of illegal items that they claim might tie the Italian restaurant to a larger crime syndicate. This may be just the tip of the iceberg. Certainly chilling stuff, and there are reports the vigilante possibly had a sidekick? There was thought to be a sidekick, Tom, but further investigation showed it was just some little twerp with diabetes. Thanks, Midget, and of course, the question on everyone's minds now, who is the farting vigilante? This is going to make us look bad. You fucked up. It wasn't our fault. This kid just came into the restaurant and started farting like there was no tomorrow. All you Italians are supposed to do is move the product. The Chinese and Russians do the rest. Everything has to be discreet and quiet or people are gonna learn the truth. That we put the product into people's drugs and alcohol in order to create more crime. You just keep doing your part in getting the cheese out on the streets. Or maybe I'll start dealing directly with the Russians. Or the Chinese. Or the sixth graders. Oh man, what a great sleep. Yeah, I haven't slept that well in weeks. <sighs> so, you guys do anything interesting last night? Oh, no, you know, the usual. Just watched some TV and went to bed. Yep, nothing exciting in our b boring lives. Well, then, I guess I'll just be seeing you guys tomorrow. You've got a big day ahead of you, new kid. Get changed into your superhero costume and wait for a message from the king. How do you do that? That was dumb. But Lord, it's time for us to get the information we need from Classy. Any good superhero should know how to interrogate. Get over to Jimmy's house and find out what she knows. Keen app. Oh, it's you again. 
up, hero? Don't be farting in my face and shit. Hey, Fast Pass, one of your super homies is here. Oh, hey, new kid. The coon told me he wants you to question the witness, so go ahead, have at it. Go ahead, new kid, ask her anything you want. Oh, that's smart. Using the silent treatment can really make a witness a antsy. I look, I know y'all need my help and shit, but I ain't talking to you go get my medication. Y your medication? Yeah, I can't think straight without my medication. You gotta go pick up my prescription, all right? Until you get my prescription, I ain't telling you little heroes fuck all nothing. Well, all right, fine. Looks like you got more work to do, new kid. But before you go back out in the world, I want to show you something that might help your crime fighting. Let's get up to my room, to bed. All right, new kid. It's time to take your superpowers to the next level. Go ahead and stand in the DNA fibrillator. All right, new kid, just stand still and I'll talk you through this. Check out the new hero DNA slot I opened up for you. Stuff you insert here will make a big impact on your combat pa 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 your combat pa effectiveness. Pick the one that best suits your power loadout. Just keep in mind that a big damage boost may mean less health, or vice versa. Kind of like how steroids shrink your buffs. Or so I've read. Well, all right. Now you know what real power feels like. Pretty dang good. That should do it, new kid. Hope you have a grasp of it. Now get out there and kick some booty. <laughs>